Okay, so I'll have an extra question by DGM01904, otherwise known as Danny, who asked me why she I moved to England in three years. I'm already in England, she wants to move here. Um, she's asked the pros and cons. Ugh, obviously because I haven't been anywhere in England, I can't really say all the pros and cons, but I'm going to list you three. The pro, you get a uh, free healthcare. Until you, I can't remember if it's until you're 18 or whenever it is, you do get to free healthcare. Um, yeah, I'm stuck at one. <laughs> um, let me think. I don't know anything else in my video. Jesus Christ. Um, well, okay, the countryside or the scenery, I guess, like, um, we've got plenty of museums, parks, um, attractions, stuff like this. There's a whole variety of things. You can literally search for where you want to go. Um, like, I went to the National Arboretum at Alawas, uh, I think it's was last year, or less than a month before. I think it would be my place, but there are plenty of places for like um, your specific activities. So if you like music, there's a, there's a theatre in my city called Belgrade Theatre. Um, you can go there and do music stuff. There's loads of places where you can actually, like I said, type in even Google and um, see what's through there. It's kind of fun. Uh, Guess in any area there's always a place where there's cheap housing. So say like if you move, obviously you should move here. Um, there's always the renting. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know really. I think I can think of way more cons and pros. You ask the wrong person, you're down the road. You get off for like going to Manchester. <laughs> um. Hmm. I really don't know. I could say I could say more pros when I'm when I'm not feeling the pressure of being recorded. Ugh. Yeah, I'm so stuck. I'm gonna have to list some cons now. Um, the only downside, like I said, you can get this anywhere in the world, any area, any city, in the village. Um, the danger side. I live one road of the main road and the police station is kind of down the road but it's not far area. Um you get a lot of not not violence. Uh I can't think of the word for it now. Um each area has its own like record of there's no criminal activity. There have been stabbing, killings, I mean you get this everywhere, I mean it's like that whole thing with the, I think it's Colorado, theater with the, the Batman and everything. Back to the main pieces, but you get pros and cons of living anywhere. This is kind of like a rambling video, so you just better not even listen to me, to be honest. Um, the downside at the moment is the economic market. Um, apparently it's a double dip recession. I don't see how, I didn't even know we would come out of a recession because, like, the prices are going up, not the taxes are going up. That was like, you're cutting wages, but ever, ever tax in prices is going up. So it's kind of like, you're expected to pay this much with this much money, and it doesn't make sense. And the government, don't even get me started on the government at the moment. In three years, probably, it would be much, much better. Because right now, um, specifically talking about my like, education, they're making the exams harder when they're already hard enough as they are. And then they, at the moment it's most glacier and don't get good grades. So if you make it harder, like say it's that, that's the level it was, like say like for example A level. Here's the level for A level to start with, it's moderately or like moderately easy, we can pass it. And we boost it up to there straight away without gradually going up 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 and then moving that level. We're going straight from there to there and expecting it to pass at a higher rate. It doesn't make sense. So at the moment I can say way more cons and pros, probably the way it is at the moment. Um, but hopefully in three years things are better and we'll probably find out more information. So yeah, I kinda hope you've enjoyed my rambling five minute video. Bye yummy.